Hello guys, welcome to the another session on AutoGPT installation. As I said earlier, this will be the second method of installing AutoGPT on your system. First method was using command prompt and this one will be using VS Code that is Visual Studio Code. So as I said earlier, we require some tools to be downloaded. So let's start downloading each tool one by one. First of all, download Python. For that, search download python and click on the first link that should be python.org click over here and this is the latest version 3.11.3 so once you click it and it will start downloading currently i am cancelling this download as i have already downloaded this stuff next go to url bar and type download auto gpt Make sure it is github.com and here it is written significant gravitas. Now as I said earlier that the code always gets improved by all the developers. We should download which is the latest one and you can see here it is written 7 releases. So click over here which is the latest one. Here you can see what what's changed since the launch of auto GPT. Scroll down and look for source code zip file just click over here it will be downloaded quickly next go to the url bar and type download git confirm it is the same logo which is currently being shown in your, on your display click over here and click on windows next click over here which is 64 bit git for windows setup and the download will be started again i am cancelling because i have already downloaded it if you want to check if your system is of 32 bit or 64 bit you can click start type this pc and here in properties after clicking properties you can see that whether it is whether your system is of 64 bit or 32 bit so my one is 64 that's why i downloaded 64 bit and final type in the url bar that is download vs code so it is code.visualstudio.com click over here and in under windows and user installer click over here x64 so it is saying that thanks for downloading if it is if it doesn't start automatically you can click over here that is for direct download link but my downloading is started and again i'm going to cancel it as i have already downloaded the stuff so this is the folder where i have pasted the, all the files which are required to run auto gpt now first of all right click on the auto gpt zip file and extract it so the files are extracted and these are the files which were reflecting on github let me show you see all the same files next install git double click on exe file click yes click next now during this installation don't check or uncheck anything and leave everything as it is do not check any boxes and click install i am not going to install currently because i have already installed git in my system next install python as i have already downloaded and installed python it is asking me if i want to modify repair or uninstall but you will not be asked these questions if you install the python for the first time next install vs code accept next next and install but i will not install right now because i already have vs code one thing i forgot to inform you that when you install python there will be a checkbox mentioning add python to the path you will need to check that box to satisfy our purpose 
so after the all the installation is complete open vs code now because i have already open vs code and ran auto gpt the history is restored but if you open first time you should click on file open folder and go to the path where you have pasted the folder auto gpt and select that folder make sure that you don't go entire the way inside the folder you just select the folder and it will be opened it is asking me if you trust this author or not click yes i trust the author now look for the file name env.template and click over here so here we need to do some stuff you can see that it is written open ai api key and your open ai api key here we need to paste the open ai key so go to url bar and just type open ai api key click on the first link these are the keys which were already created by me sometimes before but i will show you how to create the new key click over here create new secret key give it a name which you remember and click create secret key so the key is created here it is written that api key is generated click over here on this rectangular boxes say and it will be copied click on done come back to vs code and paste the key over here press control v now scroll down a little bit and come to the section of pinecone here we need to paste two things one is pinecone api key for that go to url bar and just type pinecone.io hit enter click over here sign up for free don't worry about this message just you continue with google select your google account click here where it is written api keys now this is the key which we created in previous video but we will create the new one click over here create api key i will give the same name which i have given in open ai api key and that is test 03 auto gpt no uppercase special characters and space are allowed only numbers small characters and hyphens are allowed so click over create key the key is created click over here to copy the key value now come back to vs code and paste it over here now come back over here and in the environment column copy whatever is written over here and paste it after pinecone environment okay now it's time to rename this file right click over here click rename remove template and just keep dot env as it is hit enter now go to terminal click new terminal now you can see that we are at the exact location where i have pasted the auto gpt folder let me show you that see volume d b10x install method 2 d b10x install method 2 auto gpt so here you need to type pip space install space dash r space requirements dot txt hit enter you can see that it has started downloading something let the downloading finish 
you can ignore this message. It is also asking that a new release of pip is available and the version difference is mentioned if I want to install it or not. If I copy this line over here, it will start upgrading my version, but I don't want to do it right now. So we are just one step away to run auto GPT and that is to type python space dash m space auto GPT and hit enter. So welcome to auto GPT and we have successfully installed and make it run. See you in the next session. Happy learning. Thank you.